Hello and a warm welcome to the Donbass Arena, this vast venue in Donetsk. My name is Derek Ray and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man Stuart Robson. And we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It's Shakhtar Donetsk up against Inter. Yes, cheers, Derek. Well, what an occasion it is for this club and its supporters. These are the games that they dream of. No doubt in there, the underdogs. But if they can frustrate their opponents, stay in the game up until half-time, you just never know. Hopefully, we get a great cup tie and maybe even a massive surprise. Well, on paper, they look a very balanced team. But the three advanced midfielders must at times make runs beyond the centre forward. Otherwise, they might just lack a bit of penetration. And a look at the Inter team. Samir Handanovic begins in goal. Stefan de Frey plays with Milan Striniar in central defence. Hakan Chalhanolu starts alongside Marcelo Brozovic in the centre of midfield. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage match day one underway. Went in strongly, decisively. Brozovic. Barella has it. Well, you know, wherever he's gone in his long career, Edin Dzeko has always been a prolific goal scorer, Stuart. What do you expect to see from him today? At the moment, he's playing with great confidence. Every time he gets the ball, he looks like he's going to score, as his record in recent times will suggest. Three goals in the last three games. He's been brilliant. Cross could be useful. Taking care of business defensively here. An attack full of promise. It's with Smiley. Now, what can they do from here? Must take the lead here. Oh, but he's missed it. How on earth is this still level? Well, I just don't know, Derek. Just a real lack of composure in the end. They should be ahead now. Brozovic. Barella has it. And an astute piece of defending. Ismaili. Looking for that final pass. Looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Well, tremendous block. Stepanenko, mastery of the passing game. Now he must favour the cross. Just over the crossbar. Jekko, an incisive pass. Well, it looked like it might lead to something very positive indeed, but a useful interception. 
Stefanenko. And the emphasis is on creativity. But they took care of the situation defensively. He'll have a go here. Well, the keeper making sure that was pushed well away from danger. An opportunity to forge ahead from this corner situation. Over it comes. And the danger is still there. And problem solved for now. This might be ideal for the counter. Do they have the guile to open up the defence? And a goal! 1-0 it is. They've been pushing for the opener, and now they have it. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive, but there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Magnificent read, fine tackle, Stefan de Frey. Alessandro Bastoni. Ivan Perisic. Chalanolu. Martinez. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. An effective challenge. Martinez. They've regained possession. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. Tete. Solomon. Maicon. And the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Well, I think Ivan Perisic was enjoying himself in the first half, Stuart. What did you think of what you saw from him? Well, it was certainly a good first 45 minutes for the lad. Obviously, he got his goal to put them in front, but he's looked lively throughout too. Hopefully, we see more of him in the second half. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Barella. Just looking for the right moment for that final pass. Brozovic. It's with Chalanolu. Martinez. A glorious chance. Well, a poor effort when all was said and done, and simple for the keeper. Well, he's made a real mess of that, hasn't he? What a chance that was. Unable to keep the ball that time. Alessandro Bastoni. Ivan Perisic. A really sumptuous ball. The pressure was on the keeper following the threaded pass. Eccentric goalkeeping. Dzeko. Damian. Now Brozovic. Just too much on that pass. Half an hour remaining then. And do they mean business on this occasion? And let's give credit to the defending. Martinez. They really had to be on their toes defensively, given the circumstances. Tete. Maicon. Traore. 
Oh, that pass easy on the eye. Defended well. And the danger cleared. We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. It is a decent looking attack here. Stepanenko. Not the pass he had in mind. Plenty of running room in the wide position. And teammates to play it to. Must score! And a goal it is! They lead by two now. Fully deserved. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Well, a second goal for them here. Strength and control, a big part of his game. Solomon. Oh, is he going to be punished here? It's got to be. Full credit, wonderful stop. It's going to be a double substitution. He's driven in the corner. I think the referee was spot on there. A free kick in the end after he had attempted to play advantage. And he slots it home with confidence. Well, let's just look at that again. What a penalty this is, right into the top corner. He strikes the ball so cleanly, no stopping that one. So there we have it, 2-1. We might very well have late excitement here. Five minutes to go and just one goal between them. Messino. Well, it must be mighty annoying when you can't get near the ball. Barella. Vidal. And it's whipped in early. And offside by a very small margin. Maicon. Oh, he's given us away. And we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here. Gives it a go. Great save by Handanovic. Time is not on the side. This corner could help the prospects as they look for an equaliser. Now the delivery, and a struggle to get it away properly. So full time it is, and a morale boosting three points on the board to begin their European campaign. Yeah, that's a good win and a vital three points. Another win next time out, and they'll be in a great position. Well, a special contribution from Ivan Perisic. It was an eye-catching performance from him. Stuart, how would you sum up what he put into the game? 
Yeah, he'll be happy coming off the pitch. He worked hard, he was always involved in the game, and he scored a very good goal. That was an impressive performance today.